Okay, here we are, and we can see a recently dewatered little side channel thing. So this is the result of the up and down hydroelectric, we think, hydroelectric manufacturing. It creates this kind of thing. And it's not necessarily the best for the river. So hydroelectric secondary to water supply. They don't even talk about the environment, but you can see here how it goes up and down. And the reason that I'm trying for an environmental water management plan, which NID with no doubt at all made it very clear to me they will never do, is for the water rights, for the water for the river. An environmental management plan for water right 5634 to nourish our Bear River because it has been left out of the water rights from colonization, settlement, and genocide. Bear River needs and wants the water rights. It's been at the mercy of the exploitation of settlers, colonizers for 200, over 200 years. See, this is an area that was uh, inundated and then dried out, dewatered, probably may be inundated again by six tomorrow morning, dewatered, inundated. And that's in the quest for the dollar, the almighty dollar. So, oh, there's a, a goose going down the river on the very far side over there. Okay, well, so we're going to have some time by the water now. Oh, Matakwayas and Maniwachoni.